Okay, folks, this is an interesting one. We'll see if we can make this turn up looking good. It's going to be a tricky one. It's really big. Let's see if we can make it look any good. Gonna make it shrink it. It's <laughs> still big. <laughs> now, this user interface is a pain in the ass. All right, let's see what we have. I've got it laid out. It is. It's huge. It's a poncho. It's got a, it's got a neck there. It's got a sleeve somewhere here and a sleeve somewhere there. And this is it. This is what we're photocopying. We're going to photocopy the back end of it, the back side of it. So we're just going to quickly show the back. And we're going to show you try to show some of these tassels. We're going to use both my hands including my camera hand sorry folks about the poor cinematography <laughs> so to speak we're just going to line just put these tassely bits in the frame make it look really really nice uh, this is a tricky original to manhandle folks so I'm just trying my best to make this look really nice so we're just lining these up nicely and we're just going to drop the dock feeder on it this time and we've lost our settings we were so caught up in the action <laughs> right we're just going to go here photo photo paper just going to reduce that we're just going to set this silly shit up again smell garbage i wonder if it's my bin that needs emptying folks <laughs> i wonder I haven't emptied it when i should have emptied it um a bit, a bit trivial at the moment i'm concentrating on this job here i'm talking about garbage disposal a bit silly wondering if we're gonna just try and start it like this. Let's see how we've done it. Yeah, that looks interesting. Uh, don't really like it. Um, maybe tricky one we're gonna just leave the dock feeder open we don't want it squashed it looks ugly squashed uh, we're gonna try and maybe fold this over we're gonna just try and we're just gonna put the tassels there and we're gonna try and how should we fold it that's the tricky bit we're gonna try and fold it so that it covers there and it still covers there this is tricky folks um, trying to get this to work I think we're just going to leave it like this um, silly Yeah, that looks a bit better in some respects. Uh, wondering what we're going to do with it. It still looks shit. Uh, wondering if we're going to... I'm just trying to decide, folks, what to do with this. I find it annoying that I can't get what I want it to be. Like I'm trying to get it it's really chaotic trying to arrange this neatly and in interestingly on the glass I just get a bit frustrated when things don't quite turn out the way I want them to 
So, scanner just made a noise. Let's see how that looks. Yeah, that looks a lot better. I think we can run with that. Uh, we'll see. We'll soon see what my intuition has to say. <sighs> Wondering if going to drop the dock feeder on it, and we're going to. Um, add a background colour. We're going to be daring and we're going to add a background colour. And hopefully it'll, it'll come up a treat. We've got to drop the dock feeder on it to make the background colour come up in the white areas on the top of the, on the dock feeder pad. So let's see how that works. If our little daring experiment works. Uh, no, it doesn't work. There's no magenta there at all. Uh, but at least we can see the tassels. Uh, but it looks quite interesting how it's been squashed. Uh, wondering... Wondering what we're going to do with this. We're going to lift the dock feeder on it. Uh, we're just going to keep it like that. So yeah, the uh, magenta didn't turn out turn up in the design so now we've got that uh, we're now going to work with this I do think I'm disappointed that the magenta didn't turn up on that piece there uh, but we're just going to stick with this this seems to work maybe it was good that we flattened it a bit with the dock feeder let's see how we go Okay, out it comes. That's our second piece to our job. So this is a bit of a chaotic piece, trying to get all the all the fabric to sit nicely. Fabric is a funny thing to photocopy because it has so much potential, and yet at the same time it's so difficult to uh, manhandle it in the right place. It's really difficult, especially when you've got one hand holding the camera. And you have to use that hand as well. Uh, if I had an assistant, it would probably help if they could do the camera work for me. My future husband, Luigi, will probably help me in future demos once we get together and get married and get our lives together. So this is our poncho. Ponchos are normally made out of like yarn and oh shit the oh I know what went wrong I fucked up the, there's the there's the magenta now when we I should have set this on a3 not a4 so a3 is is that's why it's been it's been reduced and it's just oh fuck stupid damn thing so now I'm just gonna Put this away while the photocopy is going. I'm just going to put that away on the pile and I'm just going to come back and finish off. But basically, yeah, it's annoying when that happens. This demo is going to be fairly prolongated. <laughs> Let's see how that looks. Yeah, I didn't take out the um, background colour, but I just figured I didn't really need to fart around any more than I need to. So, we're now just going to line these up. This was a bit of a, a challenging demo, folks. Like many of my demos are often 
very challenging. Anyway, that looks nice. I think now we can call this one quits.